head. Pull the right knee in, cross the foot over to the outside of the left leg. Left arm is going to wrap around that knee and pull it into the chest. Until you get that nice stretch in the outer hip. We'll inhale, reach up through the right arm. And your exhale right there, sweeps that knee to a closed twist. So anytime that we're trying to bring the torso toward the thigh, it's a closed twist. And one of our really nice benefits of closed twisting is that pressure from the thigh on the belly is actually helping to aid our digestion, help things kind of move along through. Deepen that twist. You'll take an inhale, reach up through the left arm, and then on your exhale, bend the elbow, take it to the outside of the right knee. Deepen that pose. Take your inhale. Extend up through the right arm. Exhale. Bending the elbow. Take it to the outside of the left knee.
send the left leg out. So we'll take one more forward bend just to even ourselves out. We're reaching out for the feet.
left fingers down toward the floor. So one palm faces away from you and one palm faces toward you. And then if you feel okay here, you can sink down into the left leg, bend that knee a little bit. And it's actually hard because the hands are blocking your drishti point, so it's hard to fix your gaze on a spot on the floor. But you can actually gaze like down past your toes if that helps you. Now to come out of this, we're going to lift up, press the left foot down into the floor, pull the right knee into the chest. Oh. <laughs> we'll drop the right foot down. All right, over to the left side. So externally rotate that leg. Knee rolls out to the side. We'll lift the toes up in front of us. Take the hands up. So this time it's going to be left fingertips facing up, right fingers facing down. And then if you're comfortable there, you can start to sink down to the right leg. Bend that knee a little bit. Pull yourself up to standing. 